several things I don't mean. I am not one politician. I don't mean political correct all the time. I don't say people things they want to hear. I say them things I think they need to hear. I am not going to please anybody. I am not necessarily your friends. If you are not wi willing, give the least amount of respect to other living beings on this planet. If you think it is okay to eat animals several times a day, because society tell you that's not a justification. If society thinks it is okay that warm out of rights, do you then think society is right? I say not. Maybe you have to watch things from the position of the oppressed instead of the oppressor's position. What I call the victimizer mindset. I was not always um, vegan, but when somebody I was explained to me on the age of five, I was going on that moment vegan. Even one of my family members maybe make it hard. I lost likely more my father than my mother, but um, the both. Will be uh, part of the party, I think. Because of society pressure, something I have never heard. Something I also don't be a sellout. I mean, me, and you can buy me. Why you can hate me? Because you, if you hate me, shut up. I don't time for all your hate comments. I have more than enough uh, things to do. Sometimes I also not be. Yes. Popular. I've nothing the popular in my whole entire life. I was on school with a kid that been bullied. I went on school with uh, that weird kid uh, that uh, have an interest for plants and don't want to hang around with other people because I'm not a people. Surprise! A people come from the Latin word persona. Persona means player's mask. You know that large mask that ancient architects wear on the stage. The time of the Romans. And the Greeks. And Cleopatra. Cleopatra. You know, something I also not mean. What I also don't be is one anthropocentrist. I am not believe that my species or my race is more important than anything else on this whole planet. I am one biocentrist. That means I look morality from not from our perception. What can it give to me? What can I do for our species? But I look it from the whole. Complex from the whole earth, from other species as well. It's you can say, I look it from one ethical and rational perception, not from one myopic and narrow minded. Biocentrism is. The ideology that 
the whole earth, uh, the whole earth actually stands on its own and have viral. Uh, also, uh, if humans don't profit from it, or uh, so I like to refer to you uh, like um, homunculi or people because people come from the latin word persona and persona means play as mask you know like the big masks people in the middle age like to wear uh, in the time before that in the time of the old greeks that show in what kind of class and they're mean understand it is not your right if somebody else have no, stop taking the victims out of the scenario. The pigs, the chickens, they don't want to suffer. Don't think you are a victim for one moment. Because you are not the victim. The 70 billion land animals and 2.8 um, trillion marine animals, they are the victims. Are you killed? Being the people that holding a knife on your throat? Being the people that saw you in slavery? Be you commercialized? Are your children stolen away from you? For no reason, only because they want to profit from you. Are you castrated and hang upside down Castration so that somebody can make with a knife take your testicles good. from you without anesthesia? Like they do with pigs, baby milk piglets in the pig flesh industry so that they can control procreation? For one moment, for one moment, don't imagine it from your point of view. Imagine it from the victim's point of view, not from the victimizer's point of view. Because if you are the victim, you also don't want that somebody uh, watch the things from the position of your oppressor. No rape victim in the whole world, like. Uh, like it if some rapists get away because uh, people say we have to take uh, equal rights to the, f the f rapists. No, you don't take the, the side of the victimizer. You always take the side of the victim, the real victims. I am not in Russia. You know what discrimination means? Definition of discrimination. Discrimination is an arbitrary criteria or bias in favor of somebody's own group. So, the racist violates this by giving more weight to the interest of the race, of their mutation, of their species, would not make the species significant more different than the other. In the same regard, the sexist take more weight to his sex, his, his um, body, your functions. In the same way, the heterosexist believe that heteros are so much more special and deserve therefore more moral consideration than gays, uh, um, bisexuals and asexuals, people that don't fall uh, in love with men or women as the last asexual. I also I'm not proud of my species. 
I'm not proud of this. Homo Mutus. Let's call himself Homo, Homo sapiens. Sapiens means to wise in Latin. You are not so wise. We are destroying our planet. The planet Earth. 51% of all the greenhouse gas emissions are coming from animal slavery or husbandry. At least 65% of the rainforest is directly cut because of cattle ranching. Animal husbandry is according to the World Bank responsible 91% of the rainforest of the total rainforest destruction. See, 5% of all the water used in the United States is for animals. It is for animal agriculture. Only 5% is for my household. Animals eat a lot of food. That food costs also water. So animals eat food what costs a lot of water. Then they shit out a lot of these um, contents. That content coming the waterway and create worldwide something like 500 hypocritic dead zones, nitrates, fields, uh, hypocrite dead zones, because of the extreme amount of toxic waste you uh, produce by all that animals. One single pig factory produces the same amount of waste as a, of a, system, of a city of 50 people or 50,000 people. You don't have to be Iceland to come to this conclusion, people. Animal husbandry is also the main reason of, of um, world hunger and starving children in poor countries. Because the West feeds large amount of green to livestock animals. At least 51 low conservative estimate of all the foods harvested by people is fit to livestock. By my calculations I can even go up to 90%. But let me take a low conservative estimate for your conservatives. And then you still can say animal agriculture is fundamentally evil. Why? Global warming 51%. All forms of transportation 14%. 30% time. Total deforestation 1%. Maybe 3% of the total rainforest destruction is, is, uh, is logging. logging. But animal agriculture is responsible for 91% according to the World Bank. The World Bank is not a vegan industry or a vegan propaganda. Sides. So don't you can also not use that. So it's time to step in the reality, people. Make a plea. Stop making excuses. Because we don't want to hear your excuses. Just like the animals don't want to hear your excuses. Apologize for the way you are living. Make a plea and move um, forwards. Well, vegan. There is no counter argument against veganism. We are in the right. 
The majority is not right, just it is the majority. Now play that and don't play that game on me. Because history has shown that if we look to the majority, social change costs hundreds, sometimes even thousands of years to come to the obvious conclusion. The majority of white cis male slave owners were not right. The majority of men were not right when they say there are just women. How oh, can the majority of heteros are not right when they say gays don't care have the right to vote, gays don't get vote, they have not the right to vote. They are fucking wrong. <laughs> So yeah, this is how it be, the way I see it. White people were afraid that when black people get their equal rights in society, this is the society collapse and the life of whites become less far. Men were afraid that when women get their equal say in society and can vote, and get payments for what I do. Society collapse and the life of man become uh, less spiraled. Heterosexists are afraid that when uh, gays can can uh, marry, and the psychotic system of marriage allows them to marry, that the whole system collapse and that their lives become less violent. Just like meat, dairy and egg eaters of animal, of, of, actually, animal meat, animal secretion eaters are afraid that when animals become liberated and be not seems anymore like in insignificant uh, automatons, the life of this Elitist group, the, meat, the animal meat, dairy and eggs eaters, become less feral. When reality, when animals are freed from oppression from humans, the whole system becomes beautiful. And this system will still function. Just like the system still function if gays can marry. Just like if the society gave women equal rights to men. Just like if racism completely stops. So, don't be so silly people. How can you ask for things you are not willing to give? If people eat just the plants, let the animals alone, let them free, let them be happy, let them live the life they want, let them be with the beings they want in their life. I have no problem with people. The problem comes when people make excuses for animal exploitation that's when you get me angry because I am their voice because I speak on their behalf because they don't can speak our language and I find that offensive what people do to them it is not about me or about you by the way it is about living Creatures have have nothing harmed anybody in their whole entire life. Get some backbones, people. Get some posture. 
being a polyer. I'm polyster. I'm polyer. I'm polyster. A cock and a sucker. Don't be a fool and push over. See. 